out and about doing those live reports in the cold to show people the need for those coats. Yeah, and we, we have in the past raised so much money mm -hmm. and gathered so many thousands of coats. It really does make a difference out there. I was going to say, too, about that when we've been out there yeah. before, early oftentimes when we launched this, right, so many times in the fall it is still warm, but maybe this recent cold spell will help give folks a little extra drive and get them out and donate even yeah. more coats. It we certainly didn't need a big coat today because it no. was so pretty out there with the sunshine, but it started off really Soon chilly enough, this yeah. morning. Yeah, the weekend probably lit a little fire under us, so to speak, with getting the heavier winter stuff out. But now you can put it away for a few days again, because guess what? We are going to hit the reverse. Temperatures are going back up. And in fact, we're about to enjoy what should be a beautiful week of late October warmth around here for us. By that, I mean sunny, warm days and pretty comfortable nights overall. Here's a live look outside or right now. We've got beautiful blue skies on this fantastic autumn day and compared to where we were at this time on Sunday, temperatures are already running about 10 degrees warmer and this number, this temperature change from day to day will only go up from here. Tomorrow it will be even higher. So here we are. Look across all of the Midwest this afternoon. Temperatures running at least a full 10 degrees warmer for most folks out there. And you know what? That will translate into a milder evening and an even milder night as well. Temperatures area wide. Most of us are within a degree or two of 60. A few low 70s beginning to creep their way up here. VV Warsaw back towards Owenton. Most of us, though, somewhere between 65 and 70. But we'll have more company in the 70s in the days ahead. In fact, maybe not just 70, potentially upper 70s knocking right on the door of 80. So the main weather player this week is going to be a big dome of high pressure. I feel like we've said that several times during the recent fall weeks around here. But because we are on the back side of this high, winds will be out of the south. And when you combine that with what should be ample late October sunshine, our temperatures should respond pretty nicely. Here we are at 66. There's that south breeze at around 8. Let me show you your 12 hour forecast. Once the sun goes down, temperatures will drop, but no threats or concerns for frost or freeze through the end of the week around here for us. Our nights won't be anywhere close to being cold enough for frost or freeze concerns. In fact, look at this overnight tonight. We'll only sneak down into the upper 40s in the city. Future cast is pretty quiet aside from some passing clouds from time to time. This in general is going to be a dry, warm end to the month of October for us. So enjoy if you got some outdoor things you want to do. You want to rake some leaves. You got a fall project you're trying to sneak in. Not a bad week to get it done, but that all changes by Halloween. So just keep that in mind. The outlook for Halloween right now is much colder around the area, so that's still a week away. We'll fine tune that forecast, but Early indications are it looks chilly, so not as cold tonight. 49 for the overnight low tomorrow, sunny and warming up. That's right. We're into the mid 70s for high should be a beautiful Tuesday, and then that will translate on over into an even gorgeous Wednesday, Thursday and probably Friday as well. Here's your seven day forecast. Mike and Sheree, not a bad outlook overall. Shower chances creep in towards the weekend. That's still not a certainty yet, but look at the numbers though. It's still very mild out there, and there's kind of the prelude to the changes for Halloween. You see that arrow going down on Monday. Kevin, thanks for the uh the update on the 70s, that's kind of unusual mm -hmm. this time of year, but we'll take it. Talk set to resume and the actors